good afternoon, Borderland. Thank you for choosing KTSM 9 News at Noon. I'm Stephanie Shields. Now we begin our newscast with El Paso Mayor Oscar Leeser being escorted from City Hall Chambers on Tuesdays as shouts erupted. Now this happening after he broke a tie vote and voted down an ordinance that would have directed city leaders to create a policy to deprioritize abortion investigations. That quickly followed with upset groups shouting towards the mayor and continuing with a protest outside of City Hall. Take a listen. of pro-choice advocates protesting the decision against an item seeking to create policy against using tax dollars on abortion investigations. People were then heard shouting shame at the mayor. Dora Oaxaca, the former El Paso County Democratic chair, upset with Mayor Leeser, saying he asked for the party's endorsement when campaigning for mayor, but yet failed to vote in support of Tuesday's item. This was a simple, straightforward policy to come back and let the, the council know how to move forward with that. He instilled whatever he did, it was a slap on women's fa uh, uh, on a woman's face. I voted that, you know, I respect everybody, I respect everyone's opinion and everybody has the rights, but at the end of the day, we are governed by the state of Texas and we do have to follow state and federal law. There's, uh, we, we can write a resolution, but at the end of the day, we are required by law. Now, City Manager Tommy Gonzalez said the state and federal law takes precedence in this case, regardless of how council would vote.